West Covina, California. A simple carpool violation has turned into an all-out pursuit. Police utilize standard procedure for what appears to be a routine chase. A cruiser taps the rear bumper, trying to push the truck into a spin. No dice. Then, a second try. But third time's the charm. There we go. One trooper revs his engine and burns rubber, pinning the fugitive against the curb. Two other cruisers move in. Get off the truck! truck is boxed in, or so they think. The driver floors it in reverse. The truck jumps the curb and bolts back into the street. Wow, that is bizarre. The chase is on again. Moments later, cops are back on his bumper. Well, now maybe we're going to try another pit maneuver here. Oh, he's, he's going off into a neighborhood now, and this is crazy. Now he's really getting into a neighborhood that has no outlet. The suspect's heading toward a dead end. But he's proven to be an escape artist. Now here's another opportunity to cut him off. Okay, now they've got him wedged in here. This time, police take no chances. They swarm. And a new fight begins. The suspect refuses to surrender. And he's a big man. A former pro football player. Okay, they are not going to be gentle with this fellow. Now there's two officers, three, four officers now trying to take him down. That guy is tough. It takes five cops and a taser to get him under control. Finally, it's over. In this chase, the former footballer sets a new running record, but the good guys get the win.